What's going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. Um, today is day two of April Authenticity. We're gonna keep this going. Um, so, it is April 7th today. So, April 7th. So, I guess today I just wanted to talk about briefly, not too long, not make this video so long, but about emotions because I am very emotional sometimes and honestly like it's definitely something that I've been better at like I've been not as emotional as I have been in the past but I've always been somebody that like anything can trigger my emotions so like like the past month I've been fine but it's just always the slightest thing I give you guys an example somebody commented on one of my videos the one I posted last week and they said I was a narcissist <laughs> and I feel like the first 15 20 minutes I thought it was hilarious but then I don't know it just made me fucking sad for some reason I don't know why even though I know I'm not a narcissistic person it just like triggered my mood and it made me like kind of pissed off but um yeah I am I can be very emotional at times and I don't know like am I the only person like and people don't people are often like people always like like are always like I don't know never think that I'm in tune with my emotions because you know of the image I portray I guess and uh, which is very false I'm a guy who is very in tune with his emotions but to be honest, like I used to be so much more emotional now. I have definitely triggered that shit way down in terms of relationships and stuff. You know, I really don't care as much. I still care a lot, but I'm just not as emotional as I used to be. But I still have my moments and my, sh my times and stuff. So, and to be honest, also, another thing that's been triggering my emotions is I'm just so tired of sitting in the house. Like, I really miss socialization. I really miss being around people. And I'm really tired of fucking sitting in this goddamn house. This, you know, it's really getting to me. So, that's basically day two of <laughs> April authenticity. Emotions, being overly emotional. I had a whole skit I was going to do about this. I even wrote the whole script out, but... I'm not making skit videos for a while. Just because it just takes too damn long. The editing, the writing, the all the fucking nitty gritty of it, like... Ugh, it gives me a headache but yeah so emotions emotions are you guys emotional am i i mean i don't know it'd be nice to know if i'm not the only emotional fucker out there who's get like gets too emotional for stupid shit but also it also is a trying time for all of us right now so i feel like it's acceptable to be like kind of emotional i guess right now i don't know also, it's just like, I, I'm out of work as well, so like, I applied for unemployment, which I haven't been approved yet for, but, um, and I, it's not like I don't have money saved, I'm really good with saving money, but it's just like, I don't know when I'm gonna be able to work again, you know, and one of my jobs I was laid off from, so it's like, I've applied for some jobs, but there's nothing, I feel like half the world is operating right now, and the other half is sort of operating it's fucking weird so yeah anyways yeah i'm trying to take this quarantine serious i'm trying to take all this coronavirus serious you know but anyways guys that basically concludes day two of april authenticity emotions um how to maintain them i mean i don't really say how to maintain them i'm just telling you guys i'm fucking emotional you know and hate comments don't ever really trigger me when i first got my first hate comment which i don't even get many of them but when i first got my first one ever years ago i remember i, I fucking jumped out of bed and i was i was about to fucking wail on somebody i was pissed but now i just there's always some stupid ass that gets something that's always that will never will somebody that will dislike you for whatever reason so yeah there's that but um are you guys being emotional in this time are you not being emotional let me know because a bitch is emotional as fuck and um i don't know it's just one of those days weeks for me but anyways hope you guys are doing well hope you guys are staying safe and healthy 
um, don't let being overly emotional make you not take care of yourself you know yeah well love you guys take care i'll talk to you tomorrow